In this tutorial, I'll show you the best way to remove background noise from your audio or video in CapCut for Windows, PC or Mac. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. For this video, I have two videos as samples and one video has a fan running and a knock going on and the other one has a muscle car revving. And if I play the first one, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the script's eye contact we can all appreciate the noisy fan running in the background. As for the second one, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the script's eye contact feature to simulate. There's a muscle car revving, uh, and it's super simple to do this in CapCut. So I've got CapCut open. I'll click on create a project, and then just select my clips, drag and drop right there. Now, I'm going to drag and drop the first clip here and just show you how this works. It's super simple. And if I play it again, this is the original. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use this. And this is the one with the fan, and you can hear it, and a knock. There's a couple of knocks right there. So I'll select my clip, go to audio, and then from this section, you have a couple of options you can do to your audio. And you probably might want to use the reduced noise. But if I select this, noise reduced and play this clip in this tutorial i'll show you how to use the scripts icon we still have some noise so the best way to reduce noise in CapCut for windows pc or mac is not using the reduce noise feature but it may depend also on your audio or your video i found that the best way is using the vocal isolation and i'll select on that and it's going to isolate the voice in this and it, it has a percentage so depending on the length of your video it may take a long time but as you can see, it's done. And if I play this, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the script's eye contact feature to simulate eye contact with the camera, even when you're reading from a script. It's super clean and crisp. Now, the other thing I'll do here is just select my clip again and click on enhance voice because you might hear like there's some sort of echo that is going on uh, in that particular scenario. And obviously you have some intensity sliders you can work with here, but I've left it to be as it is. So let's listen again. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the script's eye contact feature to simulate eye contact. Sounds much, much better. So let's see if the same uh, a vocal isolation feature can work with the revving engine. Let's play the original. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the script's eye contact feature. So can it work? Select your clip, go to audio, scroll down, and I begin again with reduced noise. Has it worked? In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the scripts. We still have the rev. Now, let's undo that and then scroll down. Let's do vocal isolation. And it's going to isolate the vocals in that particular video. And to me, this is the best way to reduce background noise from audio video in CapCut. And once that is done, if I play it again, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the script's eye contact. The car revs are gone and obviously enhance the audio for any echo uh, that may have come up during the processing of the vocal isolation. And let's have a listen. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use the script's eye contact feature to simulate. Sounds super crisp and clean. And that is the best way to remove background noise from audio or video in CapCut for Windows PC or Mac using the vocal isolation feature and then enhancing the audio or the voice using the enhanced voice feature. I hope this video is of value to you. Thanks for watching.